hello viewers welcome back by lisa channel in this video we are going to exploring now endoscoping images and lensing so this is a very uh, important topic for me and uh, how we integrate ai uh, and uh, read the image in lensing with the help of a custom data set so let me explain one by one and uh, start from sketch so first of all you can see the demo uh, here choose and go to the data set side i have data set and test images available so i am just uh, open one two three uh, and i am also mention here uh, four to five categories we will be discuss about the endoscopy image analyzing side you can see original image and here a disease name so, okay here original images here you can see find the image processing poly ps okay so we target the ulcer bleeding polyus this is a, a common disease uh, how to analyzing with the ai so let us start from sketch but uh, in front of you uh, you can see i am upload all image uh, 164 images so obviously we see the result first then we go to the uh, from step by step side from sketch so uh, i am targeting ai medical healthcare side uh, image analyzing so also we help out the uh, image analyzing uh, uh, this ai sector into medical ai side so here you can see ulcer and uh, polypus okay so you can see let me show you uh, one two three images in disease type sorry bleeding type so three three things is available uh detection classes ulcer polypus foreign bodies so let me see where is the foreign bodies uh, anyway we start from sketch let's uh demo is successfully done so now uh, in technical point of view you go to the obviously notebook side uh by research notebooks uh from here okay and we need to segmentation so yolo 11 custom data set uh, image segmentation so okay so now how to uh, get from roboflow custom data set so uh, i have this link means uh, if you want to uh, this link is this link in uh, after youtube description site but uh, we target to uh, our side uh, i have already data set link so let me show you so you can see we are uh, open the google collab from our by uh, research platform not from notebooks so here change the runtime manage sections uh, if you have already used the any section you terminate it up. you use one section and change runtime t4 gpu card and save and uh, run it okay so before you run you initialize the hardware drivers of uh, google Golab. it's make easy to home path now installation part uh ultra lysis after ultra lysis you can see uh, this link in my description set after uh, when our uh, successfully video release so you can see images and here data set and data set we target the image segmentation okay so yolo 11 format okay we show the code obviously we just copy and paste here this is the one step now you can see overview of data set here four classes bleeding foreign bodies and uh, ulcer our last one is poly press so this is four categories and uh, you can see image label typing uh, it's uh, uh, rare cases 
uh, a lot of people not knowing about AI, how AI work. We integrate in our AI system, uh, medical healthcare. Yes, we can do it. Uh, this is the example. We build every week new use case, but uh, I am exploring two to five videos, uh, probably uh, AI healthcare side. So we target the, about the sometime uh, MRI reports, uh, also skin report, and also easily to pe people access this AI sector uh, from our side, the means by research side. So we build every week. New new videos. Our video uh, data set did download successfully. Now custom data set. Custom data set is uh, 10 easy pose is very fine. I have already done a uh, model uh, which class is 100. But in uh, in video side, we build only 10 epos. Uh, so when you increase the epos number, obviously it's time taking process. So uh, we are waiting for it about the train our model then we continue our uh, logics about the interface after you can see how we our uh, setting point of view means uh, how we integrate with our system means a dot by while file and uh, also you can see uh, about the after training part is successfully we get the uh, matrices confusion matrices and uh, Obviously, we see the batches, fine tune model, and the interface of the custom model predict the some images. So we see the data. So we need to edit. So you can see here our path, uh, all path will be successfully initialized. Now confusion matrix. After you can see confusion matrix, you can see the result chart, and now batches our model will be working fine yes or not yes uh, okay then fine tune model after you can see uh, we validate our fine tune model is working very well or not now interface uh, with the custom model okay so let me check it out about the interface of the custom model after you can see we uh, predict uh, some images so we are successfully able to see our uh, here reduction so let me increase uh, uh, eight images so you can see this is the result okay here for and body no problem so now we need to download our model first of all okay so here wait best both model will be download successfully and uh, this data set link in my description side also this uh, is our uh, py research notebook side let me show you again this one okay and also we are creating now in front of you our file so here Put the license okay so you get uh, all codes all things from here so now we allow the multiple download points okay and best model so when we successfully download our both models i am going to my folder and put here okay obviously we are open now our uh, interface chapter uh, how we set the interface and how we implement this one so use cmd first of all it's the same step i already guide to you trend to you guys about the interfacing or oh, sorry library installation part if installed i need ultra license first of all and uh, let me check cv2 and flask and uh, add Obviously, by research library. So we add it. Flask. Open CV. Python. I am already installed our dependency. So it's uh, fine for me. 
but in front of you you need uh, this dependency and that uh, this command means installation point of view i am just set here okay so you get and copy and paste here uh, in your system if you want to create environment of python and use uh, any other platforms you can do it uh, i am using cmd so python 12.4 um, reopen my uh, CMD. Now we need to discuss first of all basic libraries Flask, Computer Vision, Altalysis, Operating System, and PyResearch. And set here uploading folder and set uh, like a op result folder. You upload all images, you save this these images, and uh, set the result. So load our model, segmentation model, class name. Okay, this is our social links and number for contact and easily to trust with us. So here define the class of the flask with call the images. And uh, this one segmentation class is point of view. And processing the image, this one. Okay, so now save the annotation images uh, in the path and here our uh, website and this one is close and run flask app okay so here open the template and two files is available so not i am discussing it uh, deeply because it's not python files uh, so just you can see view the structure of the code and the structure of our implementation so okay now i am making it very simple just uh, cmd and uh, call the python and app.py when you run python app.py and load the model you will get results successfully so you easy interface uh, provide to you so just copy url and paste into your browser okay you get the results okay uh, this type of interface first of all and choose the i have already uh, some data uh, data about the test images and uh, let me show you when it's not uh, uh, initialized uh, result you try it uh, again okay so you can get the result name and here original image now i am again try one more picture okay most probably class is polyglass let me check it out the ulcer and bleeding type okay so uh, you can also validate uh, with a uh, doctor uh, these whole structure if uh, it's very technically fine so do do it carry on the commercial level otherwise you will concern with your doctor you check it out guys uh, phd holders master's level and also if i will guys it's help for you in your project if you want to select from here so you can get code it's free of course no any charges keep supporters see you in next video Keep watching our videos and subscribe our channel for more getting information updates.